A new $20 million grant program will help Rhode Islanders with housing, hunger, and behavioral health in the wake of the COVID-19 crisis. It's the Rhode Island Foundation's largest single grant program in the Foundation's 106-year history. 12 News reporter Alexandra Leslie is in Providence with more details on the grant announced this afternoon. It's new at 6. The Rhode Island ARPA support grant program was created specifically in the state's 2023 budget and applications to that program are now online. Probably the most exciting and most needed thing we will do all year here at the Rhode Island Foundation. Rhode Island Foundation President and CEO Neil Steinberg says a $20 million grant program, the foundation's largest single grant program yet, will help Rhode Island nonprofits, a lifeline for those most in need. So this money is for organizations to help them be able to provide services in the areas of food insecurity, housing and homelessness, and behavioral health. Created in the state's 2023 budget and approved by the General Assembly, the program uses money from the state's more than $1 billion share of American Rescue Plan Act money. This federal funding will give these organizations the resources to provide crucial assistance necessary to keep people housed and healthy as they bounce back in this endemic. The foundation says priority will be given to community-based nonprofits negatively impacted by COVID-19. Organizations that are located or working with those hardest hit in the communities. We know our communities of color were hard hit. We know that our elderly populations were hard hit. The foundation says applications will be accepted on a rolling basis. Which means they come in, we make the decisions to get them out. We don't hold them for any great length of time. Grant awards range anywhere from 50 to $150,000. Again, those applications are now live. The deadline to apply is February 15th. We have more information on how to apply posted on WPRI.com. Reporting in Providence, Alexandra Leslie, 12 News.